It's time for Crossbell. I'm so excited. What's the worst that could happen? Um, the city explodes while we're in it. Yes, that's pretty high up there. <laughs> I was thinking like them throwing rocks at Reem, but oh, oh, Randy that said too. that I, wasn't uh, going to happen. Right. But now I'm kind of expecting it to happen at some point. Specifically because he said it wouldn't. Welcome, eh? Ooh. Also, they really shouldn't have put ridges in the road like this because it just makes the models look bad every time they step over them. <laughs> and I want to, oh. <laughs> Yeah, right? Ooh, they got some cars. Okay, it's actually looking pretty good. The wheels are turning decently fast as well for the speed yeah. of the vehicle. It's not bad. Yeah. My, there are a lot of new buildings here. It's quite different from Heimdall. Orcus Tower is particularly impressive. There may be plenty of new buildings, but we've got a lot of historic ones, too. Since Erebonia and Calvard used to govern this place together, it's got influences from both countries. I imagine so. That large bell there is rather impressive, too. And there are quite a few orbital cars on the road. It's just what I'd expect from one of the most cosmopolitan cities in Zemuria. Oh, okay, what, which, I guess we're done now. Which, what? <laughs> <laughs> Those are the worst, I think. I don't expect every scene to be voiced. That's crazy with the amount of dialogue in this game. But there are times like that where it's like, why mid-conversation? Yeah, mid-conversation where it's like, okay, we're done now. <laughs> it's just jarring. It is. It huh. does. There are a lot of warble cars over there. I wonder if Kurt's trying to goad her here. Oh, he might be. He's kind of a little shit, so I wouldn't be surprised. He might <laughs> be trying to snap her out of whatever she's in by like getting her to be more like herself. Right. Oh, <laughs> they're both in on it together. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, yes. Yep, here, we're, oh. we're losing her. Here we go. <laughs> 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 we are. We're just uh, trying to help you. That's true. That was a thing at the end of the second game. Hmm. Ooh. We've heard handy. whispers of that. Yeah. What are you laughing at? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we're going to see him, all right. <laughs> and there will be lots of screaming when just, we do. Just one. <laughs> one very loud scream. Well, two if you count the both of us doing it at the same time. So <clears throat> It's so ridiculous, too, because it's such a deep dive reference that no one else will ever possibly get. The Venn diagram <laughs> includes no overlap other than myself. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> It just happened to work out, and the more it's happened, the more I enjoy it. Yes, exactly. As well, we've learned, the only reason I do these things is because I enjoy them. Yeah, I mean, what what else are you going to do them for? I mean, I'm, I'm glad people are watching this series, and I'm glad most of them are enjoying it overall. Don't get me wrong, and we appreciate you tuning in, but at the same time, I'm here for me. Like, yeah. we're not getting paid anything. We make zero money on the videos. We're not really trying to build the channel specifically. It'd be nice if it did, but, you know, not my full-time job. Yeah. But if I'm not amused, then what's the point? Exactly. So this is the tower that they wanted to blow up in the first game. The Tower of Power of the Hour. Right? That's world, as high world. as I can go. I can't see the top. World Conference. Wait, is this the World Conference trade? Center? It's where it was in the first last game. time. Okay. Th that's what I couldn't remember is if the, yeah, 
the different names. Got yeah. it. If the <laughs> railway guns had targeted this, you can see why it would have been a calamity because... Yeah, it's like right in the middle of town. Yeah, it would have fallen all over the place. Anybody in it, I mean... Yeah. I don't want to make a 9-11 reference, but the fact <laughs> remains that any tall building is a huge risk of that if it gets attacked. Yeah, that's also what I was thinking. Um, so yeah, it would have been bad. Good thing they had tiny children to save the day. Oh, I was going to see if it would open again. It looked cool. Oh. Well, screw it then. <laughs> we don't got time for this nonsense. Oh, there's uh, our flags. Yeah, we saw a <laughs> derpy horse that I'm sure was not here about two years ago. <laughs> exactly. Oh, um, I forget his name, but that guy. Stafford. Never know. Hello. Hello, you must be children. <laughs> Actually, I'm an adult now. Shut up. Please go to the elevator. <laughs> You're only kind of an adult. <laughs> yeah, we still have a leash on you, so... <laughs> Not really. Yeah. Yeah. This is where the references will go over our head until we actually get a chance to play the Crossbell games, although the one translation is nearly released. Hey, that's good. Um, but is this a song from that game? I don't know. Right? That's kind of what I'm curious about, is if any of, if there's any uh, overlap with the music right now. At the end of 2, I went and checked out that track, and it was indeed, so I don't know if that's the case here or not. I haven't looked into it yet, because I only just heard it. Right. But Maybe. Maybe. Now arriving at 20th floor. 20th. <laughs> Except we could sit here and it would just keep going up. <laughs> I was actually gonna um, ask about that. If, like. Yeah, no. Okay. <laughs> I could, but. Yeah. I'm not gonna waste the viewer's time. It would happen. It would happen. I guarantee you. It would be very amusing. Sometimes when they're like walking through town, they'll reach a set point and stop. They won't just keep walking indefinitely. But in that case, I guarantee you that was just going to keep looping. <laughs> Hello, I don't have eyes. <laughs> you can see just the corner of one, but yes. let's not count that. But it's basically not an eye at all at that point. <laughs> Proceed down the hall, you say. Bye. Yeah, I'm gonna go this way. Oh, there's nothing here. They tricked me. Ow. No shinies or anything? I thought maybe. Ah. Alright, that's the second door. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm unruly and I don't follow directions. Yes. But it rewards me nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ooh. potted plants. Oh, corner. What horrible gameplay. What do you have to say, <laughs> sir? Welcome. Very busy. Yes, I'm sure. Yeah, we're all very busy, sir. Yeah, come on now. Get off your high horse. <laughs> Hard enough, Governor General. Ah, uh, yes. Do come in. <laughs> <laughs> Let me in. We're here. It's good to see you again. Excuse us. Not yet. Yes, it's nice to see you both again, too. Sporting a new outfit. Rufus! Rufus! <laughs> He's lost the green, I see. It's a nice outfit. Oh, I and think yeah, it's this my is first cool time again. meeting the other two. I am the Governor General of the Province of Crossbell, Rufus Alberea. It's a pleasure to meet the new Class 7 of Thor's branch campus. He's looking sharp. Yeah, he's looking pretty sharp. <laughs> it's been some time since I last saw you, but I can tell at a glance how different you look. You've definitely gotten taller, but more importantly, you've really matured. Thank you. Though I'd have to say Eusis has changed even more than me. Yes, so I hear. 
Speaking of, you seem to have changed as well. <laughs> I'm a little taller. A little and taller. you haven't changed at all, Governor General. My height is approximately the same as it's always been. Ali. <laughs> so tactless. <laughs> Granted, your blunt manner of speaking hasn't changed. It seems you have some good friends now, though. It's an honor to meet you, Your Excellency. I am Kurt Vander, the second child of the Vander House. Ah, yes. Your father has helped me out a number of times in the past. It's unfortunate you didn't join the main campus, but I'm sure there are valuable opportunities to be had at the branch campus as well. Oh, look, level-headed Rufus, speaking about the merits of all sides of a decision. Wow, I'm shocked. Instead of, you know... Instead of a certain prince we know. Certainly. <laughs> Thank you. And you are... Your worst nightmare. <laughs> Una Crawford. Originally from the Crossbell Military Police Academy. I transferred to Thor's branch campus. <laughs> oh, I've heard about you. You're acquainted with First Lieutenant Orlando and Second Lieutenant Seeker, correct? <laughs> Further, Major Revelt was the one who recommended you to the Academy. I'm sure you've gone through much lately, but I think you'll find your new school to be a good match for you. I believe it is a good blend of the perspectives of both Erebonia and Crossbell. Yes, I'll do my best. I don't know if it's just that time has passed or if it's intentional, but I kind of like this little bit deeper take I on Rufus. I was going to say, yeah, he sounds, yeah, his voice sounds deeper and maybe a little more raspy. I don't know. Yeah. It's got a nice purr to it. Yeah. A purr? <laughs> yes. Oh. <laughs> no, okay. Speaking we're, of which. Before we're done now. It's gone. It's no longer a thing. We need to raise it above maximum. <laughs> we need go to go beyond. even further beyond. <laughs> Ooh, a cryptid. Cue That's... the Super Saiyan transformation. <laughs> <laughs> but it wouldn't be voiced right now because the no. voices are gone. It would, right. just, it it would, would just, just be, be... A, a block of H's in a text box. Yes. And then some like glowing lights It'll in be going the background. Whoosh, 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 like it does. <laughs> Exactly. All right, here's our CIR, a.k.a. our thing that we have to accomplish. Investigate cryptids. That's definitely alarming. In Crossbell. Yeah, that's definitely not good. <laughs> what is that? Well, children. Well, I have some bad news. They appear out of nowhere, and they try and wreck your face. Yes. Look at this cool crosshatch filter they applied on the Instagram post. Oh, my God. That's <laughs> so cool. <laughs> <coughs> As I say, to my knowledge, this is new. Yeah, this is new. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Concerned look and then knowing grin as he looked at her. Yeah. So it seems like whenever there's civil unrest, <laughs> yeah, cryptids just, appear. They're like... What do y'all do with your politics? Oh, you got a revolution going on? I'd love to show up and wreck your face. <laughs> we'll help you out. <laughs> Certainly could. Yeah, as I say, that is a curious statement without any follow-up. Right. Defeated by whom? Yeah, who 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 dis? Uh, no, I doubt it was the army. Wanted fugitive? T uh Vita, maybe? She could be considered no. a wanted fugitive. It's a man. A man? Uh I don't know who they're talking about. <laughs> you just seem like she might. Yeah. But Altina also suggested she might. Yeah. Couldn't tell if that was just like a gasp of an awe from Yuna or a like, ah, like maybe I have an idea. Right. 
Could be useless too. Who knows? <laughs> useless, a <laughs> wanted fugitive. <laughs> they weren't kidding, but they said he changed a lot. <sighs> so Lecter suggesting Vita is sending up base somewhere over here. <laughs> yeah. Ever since the end of the second game? Jesus, that's been like two years now. Probably. There's a lot of things being unsaid right now. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, please stop strangling the Chancellor. <laughs> I'm gonna need you to, to hold off there, son. That'll probably be what happens at the end of the chapter once we've resolved things here. Yeah. Chance to catch up and finally get some answers, perhaps. Not yeah. all of them, certainly. No, but, you know, a few would be nice. Partly. You could build a case that this fugitive could be any number of people. It could be a crossbow person we don't know. Yeah. It could be, like, Oliver. <laughs> oh, that's true. It could be anyone. <laughs> <laughs> and it's not Pretty even as much. bad as it's going to get. Wait till we see where no. they are in four. It's probably going to be even worse. Yeah. Yeah, between their familial yeah. connections and what they're doing themselves. Right. Our, our kids are super special. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, he's the true hero of Crossbell. Could it be? He beat down an evil cult and arrested the dictator mayor. Excuse me? <laughs> Before the annexation, the Crossbell Police Department had a division called the Special Support Section. Mm -hmm. Oh. There he is. Oh, and there he be. What talking about was its leader. He and the other members <laughs> overcame so much together. Whoa, hold on. There's a dog over there. Uh-huh. Okay, there's a girl, there's another girl, there's another girl, and Randy, and, uh... That's Ella on the right. Tio on the left, okay. avoid. Okay, yeah. I don't remember the other two. Like, I recognize their pictures. Yeah. And then Rapide from Tales of Vesperia. <laughs> I was gonna say, that's so cool, they have a dog. <laughs> we really should have had Yuna look like him for this. I think I'll change that after this. Okay. <laughs> At least while we're here. <laughs> and now, he's a fugitive in his own home. Lloyd Bannings. Instructor Randy was a member of the SSS, too, actually. There he is. Yeah, there he be over there. Instructor Randolph worked alongside someone like that? Which is why they don't want him traipsing about the town. Yes. <laughs> so if this man is a fugitive, what has he done? Did he resort to terrorism in an attempt to free Crossbow? This is not going to go over well. No. <laughs> don't even joke about that. <laughs> yeah. Kurt, we just had a thing on your way into the city about not having done your research. <laughs> I mean, sure, he's in hiding now, but he's just trying to help Crossbell get its freedom back. Not to mention, he's helping people in trouble and hunting down cryptids. There's absolutely no way someone like him is a criminal. He and his friends are the ones in the right. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Okay. Three times in ten minutes. Yeah, we ran into him one time. Yeah, we, we fought him. Yep, yep, there we go. <laughs> he had a friend with him who wasn't pictured there. Yes. <laughs> you also were holding back. Yeah, you were, buddy. So it's nice of you to give him credit, but... But Altina knows. Yeah. <laughs> One Valimar call, and I think we're uh, done there. <laughs> yeah.
Whoa! The whole mm -hmm. ensemble! Mm -hmm. That's cool. That is the question. There are some smart and savvy folks looking for him. Yeah, there are. <laughs> and well-connected. That's all right. He'll join the party later. <laughs> you know, yeah, we'll just have him join Thor's branch academy. That's how we'll keep him safe. Like, I can't imagine the whole crew coming over, but it feels like, especially having already, like, had him in two for that I brief time. I feel like they're building up for him to be involved somehow in this game. We'll see him that way. Yeah. I mean, we know Crossbow's going to have a big influence. Well. Fancy meeting you here, Reen. Hey. Oh, it's a person. Huh? Oh. Remember those well-connected people you were talking about, Yuna? Here's one more. Yep, here we go. <laughs> Machius. <laughs> it's good to see you. Did you just get here? Oh, no. I arrived yesterday and came here first thing this morning. My inspection work starts today, and just like your field exercises... My fellow inspectors and I need to go greet the Governor General. Ah, I see. We just got back from meeting with him, actually. Good luck. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm ready for him. They're like, hey, are um, you going to introduce yeah, us? Yeah, I know. <laughs> I have paper. <laughs> yes, I'm a governor or something. I don't know who that <laughs> is. <laughs> Inspectorate. Well, that just sounds fancy. And a mouthful. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Handshake. Oh, oh fist bump. Fist bump. Machias! We're clear to visit now. <laughs> Who in the hell is that? We heard him in the background before on the phone call. Oh, yeah, we did. Random dude. Okay. Hi. Reiner, right. Yes. <laughs> For real? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Machias is pretty bright, but Rufus is... Um... Uh, Rufus <laughs> is in a league all his own. <laughs> I'm motivated. We haven't checked it for one time yet. <laughs> yeah, we haven't even checked it at all. We Look, literally got the paper and then, like, the envelope away. just opened and we tore off the seal. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Two required and an unread that has the great crossbow bake off. Oh my god! <laughs> That's That's revolutionized the world of bread, but no soggy bottoms. No soggy bottoms. <laughs> I want the thread to be crisp. <laughs> and you have to. Uh, <laughs> 
Don't overprove the bread. Yes, it was, it was underproved. <laughs> underproved. <laughs> she spent more time in the proving drawer. <laughs> oh my god, I hope you're ready for us to make references to the Great British Bake Off for the next however many hours that we're recording today. <laughs> but in this technical challenge, the bakers will have no idea what recipe they're using. <laughs> It's so good. Yeah. No cryptids among the three tasks we just got. Yeah. But we do have some spots where we need to check them out along the way. Swampy area by the boat shack. I'm sure we won't see any. Oh, no. I don't think we'll find any. They're all just conveniently dead. We need to explore the city, too. Exactly. It's gonna take us all day, y'all! Oh, is that where she lives? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone noticed. Yeah. Could it be? Is it she? <laughs> Pointed look. Eyes, yes. <laughs> All right. Check your notebook. Yeah. Police, open up. <laughs> oh my god, this guy's sweating. He I knows I'm the police. 2.0, oh god. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's freaking out. Yeah, he's okay. just having a slight meltdown. So, nothing else in the building. Time to head outside. We have two red exclamation points. One for, for each of our required quests, presumably. <coughs> Bless you, I think. Thanks, sorry. Yeah, that was definitely a, a sneeze. We gotta keep our eyes out for like a cough. <laughs> any green stuff. Nothing here. Hello, yes, I'm the police. You will answer to me. Are you Reen's mom? <laughs> oh my god. Alright. She goodbye. looks like she could be. This is so weird. I know. It's a little weird. I mean they're not the same. But it's too similar. This is going to be more of a linear approach to the city. I mean, it is going to be quite big, so I could see why. And maybe it'll do the different areas in the subsequent days. The Roman numerals on that clock are backwards. Oh, no. <laughs> That's embarrassing. It went counterclockwise. <laughs> no, no wonder Crossbell got a next. The <laughs> yeah. time is all wrong. They don't understand time at all. <laughs> I wonder, nice. I mean, like, in Japan, they read backwards, or at least in relation to how we read. Ooh, so I wonder if their clocks are also reversed? I have Ooh. no idea how that works. I've never seen an analog I, clock in I Japan. I've never seen one there either. I'm curious now. You don't really see analog clocks almost anywhere anymore, except, like, office buildings. Right. And they're really just there to be decorative. No one actually uses them. <laughs> no. If I had to poll people in my office, at least a couple of them would get the answer wrong if I asked them what time it was off of that. Yeah. Which is sad. Yeah. But, you know, sometimes things go by the wayside. Remember rotary phones? No, you don't. I do. Well, no. I, mean, I don't remember owning them, but I know they existed. <laughs> you only know about them because of the Jackbox Party Pack 6. That's fair. <laughs> Where they don't even work. Although I, I have yet to actually play that minigame. So I'm we'll over two on it. I think... It's a minigame in Trivia Murder Party 2 where you have to dial a rotary phone that shows up on your phone and, like, be the first to enter this phone number, except it doesn't show up on my phone. Right, yeah. So I'm dialing blind. Yeah. Because I have actually used a rotary telephone a couple times. Boat. Whoa, that is a crazy looking boat. Jeez. Me I'm surprised it doesn't have Mishi's giant face somewhere on this boat. Begin the patrol. 
Okay, over there. A whole bunch of shit over there. <laughs> a fishing yeah, spot. We got a star, or a green star over by us, kind of. And an, a crossbow branch of RF. Okay, well, let's go to the Huey 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 Trading Limited. <laughs> Should this be a thing to send a monk, maybe? Oh, yeah. Maybe. Ooh, is Lloyd hanging out here? Hiding out here? Hmm. Mm. Nothing of it at the moment, but maybe it unlocks up in later. Will you even let me do this just out of curiosity? Yeah, say it's it's got orange dots. That probably means no. Yeah. <clears throat> I suppose it makes sense. Keep people's searches limited so they're not like running all over the place. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's go check out these shops. Ah. Oh I guess my I probably God. should have suspected. Oh yeah, what do the drinks say? Same thing still, Falcom brand. Looks like it. Doctor, uh, something. Not not actually Doctor Pepper, but Doctor. No, it was Doctor Paper, I think, Paper. or something. Yes. Yeah, Doctor Paper. <laughs> it quenches your thirst. <laughs> um, I mean, this one's closer, I suppose. Let's go here first. Uh, that might take us to the island. All right, I changed up my mind. <laughs> All right, harbor still got to be first. Oh, maybe not. Oh. Hmm. Oh, we yep. know those initials. That's indeed true. I'm not talking to you, sir. Go away. <laughs> Looks easy enough. Yeah, yep. Straight line. I suppose, since it is a Ryan for a building, to check out the stuff on the sides. That should be more well modeled than it used to be. Oh my god, did I just see the courageous on the thing next to us? <laughs> Perhaps. We have. A boat? I see a boat. Watercolor and a woman. girl with book. Oh, I thought we it was have... with a baby, so that's probably. <laughs> with a fork makes more sense. <laughs> the thing with a fork and knife and plate on it, a boat, and some kind of silhouette by a window. Yeah. Anything over here that's interesting? There's a, there's our a face. flag, our stupid yeah, flag. Yeah, horse face. Oh, it's the courageous. I can't interact with it unless there's a plaque on the front of it or something. There is a plaque on the front, but I can't interact with that either. Huh. All right. Addison. Well, actually. <laughs> We're too early. Damn it. To the harbor, then. Reading just casually giving his phone number to women. <laughs> As he does. <clears throat> we'll look forward to your call. Say only people in Japan. <laughs> yeah. Please look forward to it. Yeah, that's a thing. All right. Then I guess it's the Mishi after all. Oh, God. Hold Meow. on. I'll make this better. Or maybe I won't. What happened now? Oh. <laughs> oh, I ran into oh. a thing. Alright, we'll turn it off. Okay. What's happening over here? Is that the RMP person right there? Or is it just a random guard? I can't tell.
That's scary. <laughs> no, we don't have those in Erebonia. <laughs> The CMP. Oh, I see. <coughs> and the RMP. Oh, okay. See, they, they, they are here. Yeah, because Claire wore that type of uniform at one point. Yeah. Well, why else are we here, then? <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to! Alright, well... Done everything here, I guess. We gotta go yeah. check out that fishing spot, and then I guess we'll head to East Street. Yeah. Can I get through? Yes, I can. Ooh. Your gates mean nothing to me. Hmm. I can see Very a lot well. of fish here. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. There. There. Got a bite. This is promising. Ooh, that's a. Okay. <laughs> Just, just just wants to come join me. Yeah. Not bad at all. A puffer. Puffer. I mean, we have to try again. This crossbow there could be any number of new fish. There. Plus, I get to hear him say the word Not again. <laughs> Our very <laughs> nice. favorite thing. Ooh, it's a um. Whatever this fish is called. It's a whopper. How did you get here? <laughs> An azel fish. <laughs> get out of here. There. He followed us. <laughs> Got a bite. We threw the last one back and he swam all the way over here because he's dedicated. Promising. Long yeah. fish is long. And doesn't put up a fight. <laughs> we do have a lot of gear. If we, the, we, I'm sure if we didn't have all that whopper. money, some people wouldn't be able to afford all the attachments we got so far. So that's right. fine. Save us some time. Yeah. All right. We'll leave that be for now. Up to 12, though, so if we keep getting them every three, we should have a new reward waiting for us when we go back to camp. Yeah, that'll be pretty nice. Can I quick jump? Not really. This is kind of haunting. It is. This is not like a... I wonder if this is like a remix of the original town theme. Because it just sounds very kind of sad. Ooh, they have like a whole eastern area of their town. That's cool. It's East Street. I guess that makes sense. No, no, we don't. <laughs> he means that seriously, but I like to imagine it sarcastic. <laughs> yes, this truly is the greatest. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's a thing. Well, I mean, everybody wanted to close all the bracers there, so why wouldn't they want to close the guild here, too? <laughs> Yeah. I want to learn recipes. I want to make food, 